Welcome back guys. We're out here, the Homestead, 100 yard range. We're gonna play with the 20 gauges again. We've got the 14 and a half inch shock wave with the turkey choke. And we've got the new CZ Upland Ultralight 20 gauge with a 28 inch barrel. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the same ammo, shooting the same distance targets, and we're gonna see what kind of variation we get with a 14 and a half inch barrel versus a 28 inch barrel. We're gonna shoot it through the chronograph. We've got two different types of ammo here. Let's see what uh, what the difference in these two these two guns are with the shorter barrel of the turkey choke and a longer barrel with a modified choke. All right, we're gonna start off with the left target, Mossberg Shockwave 14 and a half inch barrel with the turkey choke. We're going to shoot the seven and a half shot first, game load, and then we're gonna shoot the number three buck. Okay, seven and a half target load. 10.56 and the number three buck, 10.96, 10.56, All right, right target with the CZ 28 inch barrel, shooting the seven and a half first. Eleven ninety six. And now the number three buck. Twelve thirty one. All right, let's go take a look at those targets. Here's the Mossberg shockwave, and you can see the pattern for the seven and a half shot. Looks really good. These are at uh, 25 yards, by the way. And the number three buck, it did spread out. It did spread out, but we got a number of impacts. I think I counted 13 on this one but the seven and a half looks good. Number three buck is definitely tighter with the 28 inch barreled CZ Upland Ultralight. The number three buck is tighter, but the seven and a half shot, it's a little bit to the right. That's probably me more than anything, trying to avoid the uh, chronograph. The pattern of the seven and a half looks very similar in coverage to the 14 and a half inch barrel shockwave with the turkey choke. So for a critter gun, I probably wouldn't use the number three buck for a critter gun, unless it was a coyote or something of that nature. But the seven and a half shot could definitely be a, a squirrel, a squirrel getter, a rabbit getter. And what I'm looking at here is the 28 inch barrel over under with a modified choke is giving me a very similar pattern. This is the CZ again. It's giving me a very similar pattern to the shorty 14 and a half inch shockwave. The shockwave, you can hold uh, five in the tube, one in the chamber and four on the gun. So you got 10 rounds on the gun. And the over under, as sexy as it is, only holds two rounds. You could carry more on you, but that's pretty cool. I, I like that the shorty truck gun that I'm putting together is showing a seven and a half shot to be a, a good critter getter. And it's right in line with the CZ Ultralight, which is, I would consider the ultimate critter getter. Uh, it's a fantastic gun, by the way, but. I wanted to compare my little truck gun to a actual hunting gun. So yeah, interesting result. Thanks for watching guys. We're gonna have more coming at you here real soon.